Well guys, AMC just opened this section on their website about us. As you can see, we are talking about the earnings. Submit your questions for earnings webcast. AMC is pleased to invite AMC Investor Connect members to submit questions that they would like to consider to be asked of management on the next AMC quarterly earnings webcast. Okay guys, during this year we praise a lot Adam Aaron and his team. They definitely did a fantastic job managing the company, opening the company for different businesses. But now it's time to ask our questions and to express our concerns for the coming months and even the coming year. So this is my top priority question that I'm going to address. I'm going to ask Adam Aaron and his team. Remember, AMC and Adam Aaron are aiming to use this additional provision of 25 million shares and they said that they plan to issue these 25 million shares in 2022. The problem with this is not all the media attention and all the bad things that they're gonna set for potential the dilution so on and so forth. The bunch of shares issued in 2021. But the problem here is that there will be more room for the shorts borrowing the shares and playing trading against us. Again, this is not the 100% possible case, right? These shares might go on the market and they might be purchased from individual investors. Uh, we all know, especially now AMC, it's not as expensive as it used to be back in the summer when the stock was trading at 50, 60, 70 dollars, right? It's very, very hard to push people. It's much harder to believe that people will actually buy 25 million shares of AMC when the stock is at very high levels. It's very expensive and it's normal and it's understandable. But now the stock is in much lower range, almost half of the price that we saw during the summer when we saw the other issuing of the shares. So my question for Adam Aaron and his team will be, are they still planning to issue this additional 25 million shares? Are they planning to issue these shares one time, big time? Are they looking to sell these shares to individual investors on the open market? Or they're planning to sell or they seek institutional investor to invest and purchase one time, big time, these 25 million shares? Second question will be if they are not sure, because we all know the reason for companies to issue additional shares is to raise funds. AMC so far had an amazing year. Uh, I don't know what will be the revenue, I don't know what will be the last quarter earnings, but in my opinion if AMC actually surpassed the goals, uh, definitely I think that this additional 25 million shares would be optional. Because if the revenue goals are not met, if the revenue is not as good as they expected, uh, these 25 million shares issuing uh, could be uh, much stronger. Otherwise, if the revenue is not amazing, these 25 million shares issuing could be like a goal, not like an option, if you understand where I'm going. If you're asking me, I'm not so hype about these shares. I don't think that these shares will have like a technical impact over the squeeze or technical impact over the numbers. But what I think is that definitely people who don't have hype around AMC, people who don't have good or positive intentions will use this one as a leverage. They can create definitely build up the case out there and chase off some of the people who are 50-50 around to invest with, with AMC. So I think this definitely it's not good news it's not helping the squeeze again guys i might be wrong this is uh, only my opinion let me know in the comment section what do you guys think about this and what are your questions that you want to address uh, during the webcast the webcast is is coming it's right around the corner so make sure to to submit your questions and let's see uh, more information from other meron it's better than more information from any other media because we definitely care about the source of information. So leave your thoughts in the comment section, subscribe to the channel, like this video and come back for more.